Hi Sagittarius, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Sagittarius, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Sagittarius. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck we have the temperance and this is your energy you could be dealing with another Sagittarius as well and I am seeing here that, um, this energy is an energy of very calm energy so you may be connecting with someone who is balanced somebody who is he healing or who has healed um, or this could be you going through this right now you may be in a healing process and trying to really balance out um, your your emotions your feelings and um, also I, I see this also as an a, you know an energy telling you that you are making progress in this um, you may even be getting some sort of communication from someone um, and this communication could be putting you in a state of feeling balanced, feeling um, reassured, feeling at ease and peaceful. So you could be getting that from um, somebody I'm seeing, um, you know, really um, sincere energy with this temperance card. Okay, so let's see what the rest of the cards have to say about this Sagittarius. Okay, so the first card we have here is the Knight of Cups, and this is Water Energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio Energy. Next, we have the Two of Swords, Air Energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius Energy. And finally, we have the Knight of Swords, Air Energy again. Okay, so I do see um, there is somebody here who is coming towards you, and um, they, this is somebody who um, you may have had a falling out with, or you may have had some sort of misunderstanding with this person, and you may even be still a bit guarded towards this person, feeling like you need to protect yourself from this person with that Two of Swords energy. Um, you know, this person, it's almost like they're coming towards you um, unexpectedly. Uh, with the Knight of Swords, they are determined though. This person, even if you are showing up as guarded, they're, they're not afraid. They're still going to come towards you. They are very determined and um, they are going to show up quite assertive. Uh, this person wants to speak with you. They want to communicate with you. With the Knight of Swords, they may even be wanting to win you back. So this is somebody who you have already dealt with and you may have um, had some halt in communication with this person. You may even have blocked them or just some sort of no contact with this two of swords there was some sort of a stalemate and i do see this has um having been the result of some sort of miscommunication so this person feels like they need to clear the air and they are rushing in with this knight of swords this person is very determined and coming in quickly and they want to win you back this person is going to do something very romantic to try to um you know get you to lower your guard as well and also to show that they are being sincere this person is going to be very emotionally available Available when they come towards you and they may even um, get you a gift of some sort with that Knights of Cups energy um, or some sort of romantic gesture this person is coming towards you very romantic and charming they're going to say the right things I, I do see this person whatever they are saying to you it's giving you a lot of reassurance and calm so this person really um, I do see a charming person who has a way with words or they have had time to prepare their words very well and um, I do see the I'm coming through sincerely this person is genuine um, this is somebody who is also um, showing up as um, mature emotionally with that temperance energy this is somebody who has taken the time out to reflect and to heal as well so let's clarify these cards Sagittarius
Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Five of Swords, and this is Air Energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius Energy. Again, we see a misunderstanding or a verbal disagreement. So this is somebody who you, you may have argued with in some way or had some uh, fight. Uh, I'm seeing verbal disagreement. Um, so you and this person may have really not seen eye to eye, and um, it's almost like with this energy, this person um, and the Temperance Energy showing up, this person is coming towards you and, you know, reiterating that there are no winners in this situation um you know they they feel like they 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 don't want victory they want peace with you so this person is wanting to um bow out of the conflict so they, they want um something more peaceful with you now so let's see what the rest of the cards have to say about this sagittarius Okay, so the first card we have is the Two of Cups, and this is Water Energy, Cancer Pisces, Scorpio Energy. Next, we have the Ten of Pentacles, Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn Energy, and finally we have the Six of Swords, Air Energy. Okay, so I am seeing this person wants to move towards karma water with you, karma waters with you. This person wants peace with you. This person wants um, to to move things um, to a more stable place. They want to move away from this Five of Swords. So this person is definitely wanting to come towards you and they have genuine intentions. This person feels like you are their soulmate. This person, they feel a mutual attraction to you. They feel a strong connection and um, they see you as their divine partner. And I do see them making this known to you. This person really, there is a lot of love here. This person is coming towards you genuinely and they want something long term. This person sees you as their Ten of Pentacles. This person sees you as someone who they could do life with. With. they could settle down with grow old with um you know have a family with even a legacy you bring this person a lot of emotional fulfillment even spiritual fulfillment this person i do see that they have undergone some sort of spiritual um enlightenment or um you know they've been just really awakening more to their spiritual side and um they really value this connection, you know, on a very deep level. So this person, they, they want something long term. I do see this as someone who's very serious about you. Um, they really do see you as their person and they are coming towards you wanting to move in peace or move towards peace. Um, so I do see them wanting to uh, clear the air about some sort of misunderstanding with that Five of Swords and um, they want to uh, move on to calmer waters with you. So this person will be very generous. Um, this person is very invested in you. So they will invest a lot. They feel like they have invested a lot in this connection in you and they, they, they intend to continue investing in this because they do see you as their Two of Cups. Okay, so I'm going to pull out an Oracle card for you, Sagittarius. Okay, so the card says your dreams need a practical plan full moon in Taurus. Okay, so this person has very, very high hopes for this connection. They are thinking long term. They want a legacy. They want um, a power couple. They want something stable, something solid. And um, they are planning to come towards you. Um, this person um, recognizes the need to prepare and plan because they. Th this is quite a big um, desire to achieve with someone. So there is a need for practicality as well um, in this connection. So let's I'm going to pull out another card for you, Sagittarius. Okay, so the card says cheerfulness. It is spring again. The earth is like a child that knows poems by heart. Okay, so this person, again, they are feeling, um, you know, these feelings again towards you. And I do see this as coming after some sort of disagreement, some sort of fight. They are starting to feel, you know, their warm feelings towards you are returning here. Um, they are feeling this strongly and um, they, they want to pursue this. Um, you know, they, they feel 
you know some very romantic feelings towards you again with that knight of cups energy um so this person is hoping that they can succeed in getting you to really lower your guard and hear them out because they are sincere they are genuine and um they really do want this love with you this person is very invested in you okay so that's what i'm seeing for you sagittarius i hope you have a really really good day sagittarius bye sagittarius